very grateful. Hi guys. <laughs> what? Hmm. Vlogmas did a number on me. Hi guys. Happy New Year. Happy 2024. Um, it's good to see you here. I hope it's good for you to see me here. Um, first of all, shout out to my husband because why it's not for him? You probably have seen a vlog in June or somewhere there. I hope you guys have been doing well. Truth is, vlogmas actually did a number on me. Like, a number in the sense of, I was like, I don't know what else excuse me i don't know what else to tell you guys i felt like i had given it like i'd given you everything Sikubakisha. but here we are here we are so one thing i like about youtube is that um it's very raw it's very calm as you are type of thing compared to instagram which is kind of changing to that but instagram is very like aesthetic put yourself together all those things but here we are so i'm actually it's 11 45 today has been an interesting day so one thing um about this year is that i want to be very cautious about sorry i went right into it but it's because there's no you know you know like it's just me talking so we'll talk on the comment section so tell me how your year has begun how you're feeling about 2024 all that jazz so um i've actually not done my hair okay i was telling you so today has been an interesting day and i was going to say um one of the goals that i have for this year is to actually be cautious or be intentional about what i'm eating um as well as exercise so it doesn't have to be the intense um gym workout although i am hoping to actually sign up to a gym sometime uh, within this quarter or next quarter we'll see how it goes um but yeah so i've been doing home workouts i've been i learned about um about a lady called grow with joe on here actually on youtube and she has very nice uh workouts which are like 20 to 30 minutes and so that's what i've been doing since last week actually so today is actually valentine's day so happy valentine's day <laughs> um i don't know when you will be seeing this but um yeah morning i did my workout uh cleaned up did a few things around the house did a, a bit of work um and then i had i soaked shea seeds black shea seeds in yogurt overnight and then uh that's what i had as i was doing those markings in the house so i actually learned why because i used to wonder why do we have to soak shea seeds but they actually Shea seeds themselves have, they have something that like dissolves liquids. So if you drink it, you will be dehydrated. But now if you put them in water and soak them, they will soak enough water. So when you drink them, they'll be beneficial to you. So yeah, uh, one of the other things that uh, I am doing in relation to being intentional about what i'm eating is actually learning about foods and what's in foods and what foods help things like that so that's how i know something like that i also watched a series on netflix called you are what you eat it was a twins experiment and let me tell you i was this close to being a vegetarian because i could not believe it um but i am not an avid consumer of meat so we're gonna leave it at that anyways so right now i'm having a breakfast or lunch this is rice and lentils just mixed it up so this is what i'm having for lunch brunch whatever breakfast um and then i'm gonna fix my hair so let me tell you about valentine's day i'm usually that chick for i'm not so into valentine's hi ethan hi. i'm not so much into valentine's but um so this year one thing that i'm doing that i never do is actually wear red like you would never catch me wearing red on valentine's day but today i'm actually wearing somewhere in this uh t-shirt currently in tights but i'm going to be putting on my red palazzo pants go ahead as i take a bite how are you my lazy it's okay are you sure 
Yeah, are you done? Almost. I don't have all the space, but apart from that, um, 2024 actually had a very interesting start to it. Mm. Not sure, but anyway, yeah, so we had our laptops, uh, we were robbed and our laptops went. So that was a bit of a rough patch, um, but I think we are learning to look at the positive side of everything and just to pick ourselves up because i mean you can't just uh stay in that hole for the whole time so yeah that's how 2024 started but on more good things i have been wanting to do this for a long time i know in previous vlogs last year i was i just kept saying i'm doing this i'm doing this i never talked about it but <clears throat> my friend and i actually started a social media agency and yeah i have really been wanting to get into this space and to actually do it like from this side of it so i'm so excited we have a business it's called tammy digital registered under the government of kenya i don't know but yeah we are a registered business and basically what we do is social media we're social media agency so what we do is social media marketing social media marketing um we do content creation if you have a business and you don't want to do the content or don't know how to or don't have the time to we create for you content we do social media audits so if you have a social media page and you're wondering why you're not getting results from it then we can come in and do an audit for you and then give you like a strategy which you implement we can also implement a strategy for you uh, we also have photography, videography, all those class, all those services, of course, those we outsource. And what else do we do? We do ad management. So if you want to run ads, but you don't know how much to put in, who to target, how to target, we help you with that. And then we also do social media management. So if you want us to do the whole nine yard for you, um, from create, if it's a new business, from creating the page, to running it, to actually uh, building awareness and making sales out of your business. We do that. So we are on Instagram as Tammy Digital. We are on LinkedIn as Tammy Digital. Our email, I will also leave it down below. We are currently working on our website and I want to sneeze. Excuse me. We also have a masterclass coming up. So we actually do trainings. I have been getting that question a lot, especially since I did a video, um, I think two and a half years ago here on YouTube, talking about how I quit my job and I wanted to get into digital marketing, blah, blah, blah. And you guys, you know, a few of you ask me um, how I want to learn, I want to learn. So we finally have a class. So it's going to be, um, actually this is first hand for you guys here on YouTube. So it's going to be a three-day um, masterclass. Each day will be about an hour. If it spills over, maybe an hour, 15. Um, it's going to be a virtual one, but we have something exciting for you if you sign up. We're probably going to do... It's going to be a meetup thing. Okay, we're going to have... Yeah, I'm spilling the tea, but okay. Yeah, I'm going to leave it at that. So I'm excited. I'm excited for how the year has begun. I'm excited for what I'm being able to do because this were literally prayers that I made. So even when I say that the laptop situation took us down, it's also um, it's also a challenge for me to just um, pick myself up and look at what God has been able to do for me. So I'm happy about that. Mm. I'm actually kind of digging my... Oh, we also hit one year for the sister locks. This was like a catch-up, actually, because we haven't really caught up in a minute. So, yeah, we clocked one year with my locks. actually haven't made my hair, but I think I like it the way it is because I was going to style it differently. But I'm feeling, I'm digging this. It's giving grownish. Yeah, so um, I clocked one year with locks i know i owe you guys a sister locks q and I literally have those questions but i need the time to respond to them i think it's because i want it to be like a sit down sit down not like a vlog format i think that's it um you guys can let me know how have you guys been how's the year started for you do you have your word of the year kind of thing going on um yeah so let's chat uh thank you for the love last year thank you so much we actually grew despite 
no i was actually i tried to be consistent because i was doing this one vlog per month which is also the format that, that i'm taking uh this year with everything that i am getting myself into i think i will be able to commit to one one vlog a month as opposed to one vlog a week i do not know for the life of me how i was able to do that previously but right now i will not be able to do that so one vlog per month and the good thing about that they're going to be longer so yeah you're still going to enjoy i hope um if you are watching this video and you are not subscribed yet i think this is your cue to subscribe i think you will have a good time on this side of the internet so i think i'm gonna leave you guys here finish up my lunch uh, so i'll see you guys Hey guys, I'm not even sure if you can hear me, but we started this thing. If you follow me on Instagram, then you know. But we started this thing on Insta on. We started this thing recently where we take. Okay, me I was measuring with steps, so 10k steps. Um, huh? 10k steps every Monday. 
because it's our free day. What? Do you think we come here? Me, I don't think so. It's our rest day. It's our rest day, so we have time in our hands to walk. So we do 10k steps every Monday. So we took a different route. We started it three weeks ago, so we took a different route. Um, last Monday we were at Karura. This Monday we have taken a different route. So we are currently at how many kilometers? 2.4 kilometers. The goal is 8 kilometers. So to wherever and back home. So we'll keep you guys posted. Hey baby. Morning Top to you. Morning. This is uh, Home 100. Uh huh. And we are your host today. My name is Ethan Hurd. And uh, on my left here is uh, Chebet McKenna, the one and only, the lovely one, the, the one gorgeous, one. pretty girl. Yeah. My pretty thing, my whole thing, my everyday. Anyways, guys, so today is actually Friday. I don't know why Naka come and me parara. Today's Friday. We have something exciting. It's because the light is, is like so bright, so oh. your color is more white than brown. All right, I see. So we are on our way to, we are doing something exciting. I don't know if I can mention, I don't think I can mention exactly what, what but we are going for an interview. Uh, which of course when it's out you guys will be in the know about it but we are going to talk about rest uh, which is actually very it fell right in because first of all this last year is when we as a couple started taking rest very seriously and I was about to say some of my thoughts that I want to say on this show but anyways, so we're going to talk about rest. And so we are on our way to, that's, the hair is cooking up. What's that? The hair is cooking up. We lost one tire. <laughs> that's why it's Hello. like this. I'm also going to get my makeup done. And thankfully, it's my good sis, Wamoyo, who does makeup for that production. Um, yeah, so we are, the place is at Uko Red Hill, so that's where we're headed. It's 7.27, I think we'll be there in good time. Um, according to maps, we'll be there at 8.02. So, yeah, we're looking cute. They said also that we should try and match and, you know, don't have to say it twice. Today was at least on purpose. So. Yeah, today was on purpose. Yeah, but my camera, low key. Mm. Or probably hiking mm. enjoys much. Of course I do. Of like, course I do. As in every morning when McKenna realizes we have much time. It excites me so much. Like, oh my god, you <laughs> And then you know it's not the matching for it's matching for colours. It's not matching for a team. This t shirt is like you know, like look, we're wearing the same thing but not. You understand? I love it. Anyway, so yeah. I love it, I love it, I love it. Sorry. Yeah, so I'm gonna talk to you guys as and when I can. Of course, the boot, especially when I'm on this car, is just usually full of clothes because I want to change after this. I don't think Trust I can spend women. the whole day looking like this. This is a bit too glam for a normal work. Just be patient. Yeah, so hmm, we'll show you guys when we get there. Ladies and gentlemen. Hello. Ooh, who's that girl? <laughs> like, can you believe this is me? Can me we? Me who saw you who you saw in the morning? Anyways. 
So we are just from shooting the what do we call it? A podcast? We're sure. just from doing a shoot uh, with Betty and the husband. Yes. Well, not this Betty and this husband, but another Betty and yeah. another husband. Really which cool was, tips. Yeah, it was really amazing. I had yeah. a good time. We're yeah. talking about re rest. rest and relaxation, yes. uh, which is a fun topic. I had a really nice time. Me too. I um, enjoyed it. And, and also because we started taking that seriously last year, into yeah. this year, so yeah. it fit right in. Yeah, this is actually one of those topics that's not just a... McKenna, what are you doing? We're I'm talking. Myself. <laughs> so this is just not one of those topics where we just spoke. It was yeah, really from experience. Um, due to I'm not really I, I was not always the type Into of rest. Uh, rest and relaxed person. Yeah. And she is all about it. So I um, bring the vibes. Yeah, we are just happy to have done that. Yeah. And now we are headed to the studio. Yeah. Uh, for work and shoot. Yeah. Which but is I'm about to change. Yeah, but she needs I to can't change. Spend the day. You want to show them your feet? <laughs> yeah, that's her feet. So yeah, let's go. All right. Let's do. Hi guys. Uh, happy. Actually, we've spoken today, so it's about. I can't see the clock. Actually. It's six thirty. Oh, it's actually bright for six thirty. But anyway, it's six thirty. Um, it was a good day. I went to after we got back from the studio. I went to fix my nails. So that's what we're working with. I was. I would never in this world pick black for myself. But uh, the place where I went, uh, the lady who was doing it encouraged me, and I actually like it. I'm gonna leave a uh, beauty spots um instagram down below in case you are shopping for a nail parlor or somewhere to get your nails done um sorry i'm distracted because i just did it there and then i saw like my hair is gonna volume anyways so um i just wanted to do like a chit chat i um i am feeling very grateful so ethan went to hang out with the boys so I, I came back from town, went to the studio, and then I came home. So I actually went to get some work done, just a bit, a bit of work done. And then uh, we have an exciting week next week. So some of what I am working with is actually um, connected to that. Um, then I also wanted to say we were actually published. I don't know why my mind was wandering when... <laughs> But we were actually published on Daily Nation, my network. If I figure it out, I'm going to put it here. If not, I'm so sorry, but I'm going to leave Tammy Digital's um, Instagram down below also. If you are looking for social media services or you know anyone who's looking, that would be the best gift for us. Thank you so much. Like we've gotten so much love on Instagram. So in case you're watching here and you're one of those people, Instagram and in real life. So I just want to say thank you. Um, I think I every time I think about Tammy, it's actually a testament of like what God can do because it literally started like an idea and was still very young. Like I, I remember yesterday I was telling myself I want to think about uh, Tammy with the anal analogy of a baby. So we started Tammy last year in March, but I was still working um, a day job. So we didn't like focus on it as much because also that was taking uh, most of my time. <clears throat> So I like to think about it like we actually started Tammy maybe late last year because that's when we were, sorry, my mom just texted me. Hi, mom. <laughs> my mom actually, I don't know if they know, but they went on a Galentine's trip. Um, that's not what they're calling it, but they, I'm sure she's sending me pictures of where they were going. So anyways, um, and it's actually very nice. Like, I think my mom teaches me a lot also about friendships because she has, she really commits to her friends. And I just love to see like they're older now and they're still like keeping in touch and checking on each other and going on trips. I love it. I love it so much. So what is I saying? I to think about Tammy with the analogy of a baby. So technically, Tammy is barely one year old. And a barely one year old is probably, they just started winning. 
they just are aware of their of their environment not so much they have a little words i mean little words here and there so i want to think about tammy like that so that when it's like five years like this tammy has gone to school tammy has met new people tammy has um been able to talk and express herself so yeah that's how that's the analogy i'm using to you know just think about our business um but what was i even saying but i don't know what i was saying but i just want to say i'm very grateful and just to see that just to see that when god when god like when i when something is of god he will walk with you through through it all like he will not leave you and not leave you doesn't mean that you're going to be securing deals all the time nope i can tell you for sure we yeah we've had a fair share of reaching out and not getting responses and now we're i think we're at a good and i think i'm also trying to share but also trying to not overshare um but it's it's just been a beautiful journey for us as tammy um yeah so this week when the lady from nation reached out i remember i was just thinking do you want to interview me or the business so i was like let me wait for her email and then see what she's talking about and then she's she was talking about tammy and i was actually like wow and for me being published uh means credibility being published means people are gonna read about us uh also like get clients prospects like there are so many opportunities that even that one article could do and i am so grateful i am very grateful for that i also would like to unbox something on here um sorry i've been talking for long because i did something for my insta story so what i'm unboxing is what is holding you guys so let me fix that not the best angle but probably going to be the best angle for this little package oopsie so these were just like ribbons that were somewhere up here but it says coffee with jesus buddy for me it's the packaging like let me tell you it starts from the packaging i don't know about you but for me the packaging so it's a cute um let's unbox let me not let me stop talking but this is how oh my gosh like i just texted her and i told her like this is the loveliest package ever this is so pretty like this is so gorgeous so it's like a his and hers thing for ethan and i um so there's a mug oh and it's pink and it says coffee with jesus and then there's a black one coffee with jesus so of course this is gonna be mine and this is ethan's cute this is so so cute and then we have this is like a prayer journal this is so nice um i'm gonna leave her instagram down below i should have opened this first hey jesus buddy your coffee with jesus time is about to get 10 times better i could not agree more this this is so true she has you can see she has taken the time to are you seeing those cards oh she even i didn't see this hey there ethan and mckenna i hope this gift gift box enriches your quiet time this season from harriet dodea for warrior princess challenge this is so lovely like are you seeing this like the detail is and then we have high high as in let me tell you she has thought about this package so we have these highlighter pens um i'm assuming i'm gonna take the pink one of course Ethan is also really gonna love this. We both saw the and then there's little chocolates for both of us. Oh, this is so cute. Oh my gosh. And then now saving the best for last. Coffee with Jesus. And there's a black one. First of all, if you know me, you know I love pink. So this is just like so beautiful. So there's a black one and a pink one. I'm just going to try and oh 
how to use this journal there's a whole um there's a whole explanation of how to use this journal but i think just from looking at it you it's literally what the notes you write um the notes you write up like during your quiet time or like when you're reading the words so verse of the day what verse stands out from today's bible study knowing the god of the bible what do you learn about god from today's bible study e.g his name his nature his character what do you learn about yourself from today's bible study it's so profound and i don't think there's anyone who can read this and not say they have grown in christ and let me tell you this is so timely because um and then there's like uh credits by harriet Dodare for where princess challenge and then there's her number there i'm going to leave her instagram down below i'm also going to leave this number here you can just call her and tell her you saw this from mckenna and you would like a his and hers package also it doesn't have to be his and hers um you can just have yours <laughs> but anyways this is so lovely thank you so much harriet we are about to read the word um i think this will also help with accountability to self mostly because it's one of those things you're like i have i need to write so what am i getting no something like that so this is so lovely thank you so much um with that we may actually i have spoken so much I've spoken so much. I am. Um, I'm going to do some of that work and then I got chips and sausage. So I'm just gonna remove my makeup, wind down, and just, you know, um, eat the chips and sausage as I probably watch something. And I guess I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm meeting with the girlies tomorrow. We haven't met all of us together since November. That's a very long time. Um, but with the, let me tell you, if there's one WhatsApp group that I am in that is active, it's our WhatsApp group. We're all learning. We're, it's like we, we're, we talk like not every day, but we talk a lot. And I love that for us. Anyway, we're meeting tomorrow. I'm excited. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm going to show you guys that and yeah um thank you for hanging out with me today we'll see you guys tomorrow hey guys i am um, happy saturday first of all i am calling on all sunshines to please balance because whoops all right let's take that again i am calling on all sun trains to please balance the weather for us because it was very sad i mean very sunny and suddenly it's raining uh, but i'm glad i'm not complaining actually because it was quite dusty especially where we stay it was like 10 times dusty than your usual nairobi anyways today is saturday uh mr man here decided that this baby girl will not oh, indeed. emphasis hustle. on the baby girl he said you shall not hustle in my presence <laughs> anyways because Great i am job, <laughs> i am going to meet the girls i think i told you that yesterday no i'm not sure anyway yeah so we're hanging out today um and ethan decided to so kindly drop me off first because it's raining too because he's insecure about me taking a maternity tree because i'm a baby girl yeah and i am the lord anyways so i just wanted to intro it here uh we are going to a restaurant in parkland and um, yeah so in case i'm not able to talk at least when you guys see those clips you will understand what's going on but we'll catch up um, some other time. Uh, my famous trench coat is out because of the weather today. And, um, yeah.
I'm wearing denim cargo pants and pink shoes. We actually had, did you know we had a dress code? Uh, <laughs> what else? Bag? Trench coat! <laughs> trench coat and another trench coat is a leather jacket. Let me tell you, I first of all, I take I take it seriously when it's cold. Um, because also of the... <laughs> <laughs> because of the other allergies that I've had, babe, isn't it true? Sure. sure. <laughs> um, yeah, so we had a dress code, appar uh, not apparently, we, by the way, we had a dress code. Um, the dress code was white with a little pink. <laughs> that was the memo. I'm not wearing anything white besides this. At least I have all the pink. <laughs> it's because when we got that memo, I had planned for the outfit, but the weather today was like, nah, mom, you're not going to be wearing what you had planned for. So, hence, anyway, so yeah, we'll see you guys. I will see you guys. Hey guys, <clears throat> let's do that again. Hey guys, um, I just thought to end this vlog here. I want to start editing it and you guys will have it up probably first week of March because today is the last day of February. Um, yeah, so I just thought to end this video here because I wanted it to be kind of short and sweet so that we just get the year going and get into the groove of vlogging. Um, also, it looks like this vlog is, is, has largely been dominated by this area, this space of the house um yeah just realized it as i was thinking about what i have been vlogging about but i just wanted to end this video here i am just about to close my work day it's 5 46 um by the way do you guys work in silence or do you work with music or something playing in the background i have i used to be the person to work with something playing in the background but these days i'm finding myself preferring to work in silence i don't know whether it's age or it's just preference that's changing but anyways i just wanted to finish the vlog here i'm also going to do something that i'm not sure i'm looking forward to so let me tell you guys i have never separated chicken like you know how like a full chicken like separating the parts i've never done that before uh yeah i know i'm 20 whatever the age i am <laughs> but in all my whatever the age i am years i have never years i have never done that so i am definitely not looking forward to that part because i don't know for some reason i usually feel like the i usually feel like it's icky like it's like anyway let me not make it worse for myself let me just go and do it Thank you so much for watching my first video of 2024 here's to a vlog every month uh for the rest of the year so help me god and shout out to you guys for always watching for coming to me on my instagrams because i am very active on instagram actually so if you do not follow me there probably you should so you can you know catch up with me and whatnot but uh yeah just wanted to end the vlog here um yeah and then i'll see you guys soon bye